Hey everyone, I'm Kiyoshi and I just want to say a big thanks to everyone that supported me all the way to 100 subscribers. Because of this event, I asked some of you to give me questions to answer. Now, let's get on to my response. The first question I was given is, if your YouTube channel doesn't end up going viral, what do you want to do when you're older? Even if my YouTube channel never gets popular, I still will be continuing to do art as it's the main thing I want to do for a living. The YouTube channel helps me connect to viewers like you guys. The next question I was given was, who are the artists that inspire you? I will say I get inspired by almost everyone that I deem better than myself. So for bigger artists I look up to are Perlo, Zukic, and Jack McGee. And for smallest artists I look up to are Duchess Lesio, Fiona Apollo, Mink, and Jutsu Kuro. Now there are way more than I just mentioned here, but these are just a few. I like these artists either for their able to design characters, their ability to color, or they just have a really nice art style. For my third question I was given, it says, if you're a comic writer or a comic artist, what genre would you like to make the most? Currently, I'm not working on any comics, but if I ever would, I'll either do romance or horror. Romance because I kind of enjoy reading romance manga, and horror because I like the idea of scaring others, although I'm not a big fan of getting scared myself. Question 4 was, any advice for growing YouTubers? I'm still small myself, so I really don't have much experience, but from what I can tell, here's something I can tell you, sure. Know how to present yourself online, because the way you present yourself will affect how your community and your fan base will form around you. This can either lead up to a calm and friendly fan base, or a corrupted and mean one. And for my last question I was given, are there any future video projects you're thinking of doing or are getting it prepared to do? I have two ideas at the moment. The first idea is where I fuse characters from different shows, animes, or games into one character. The next idea is where I get people to give me their OCs and I draw their OCs more corrupted and more monster-like. I'm still debating on which one I'm planning on doing. I'm not sure if I'm going to do both or just one. You guys can comment down below to see which one you guys would prefer to watch. For all the previous questions I was given in the previous video. Now, if you guys still want to ask me a question, feel free to leave it down in the comment and I'll be there to answer it. So, thank you for watching and stay safe.